All right, guys. How's everybody doing? Uh, Kazlo25 here again. Uh, playing some more Citizens of Earth. You can follow me at any of my social media above. And feel free to hit that follow button so you can see any time that I'm here streaming. Uh, if you're watching this on YouTube, be sure to hit that like button, that subscribe button there. And share it and comment. I'd love to hear what you think. Um, with that said, let's get started. Uh, where we left off last time was <clears throat> we had just gotten out of the hedge maze and seeing the president and encountered what I thought was some really poor level design at the time. But it appears that, let me turn this down on my hands. Um, it appears that I could have gotten out of there a different way, just something I wouldn't have thought of. So I could have saved just like 40 minutes last week. But apparently didn't know. I just had my drink spill everywhere somehow. So let me clean that up real quick, guys. Yeah, if this is your first time watching me stream Citizens of Earth or seeing Citizens of Earth at all, it's got a very earthbound feel to it. Um, or it's one of those style of a JRPG, but set in modern times with real pop culture humor um, and just some real zany enemies to fight. I think I'm going to start off trying to recruit the uh, used car salesman over here. I see you checking out that sweet ride over there. You got a good eye. So, what can I do for you today, my man? So you think you're cool enough to hang with me? What kind of car do you drive, pal? I sometimes go for rides in the presidential limo. <laughs> what is that, an automatic? Bro, do you even shift? Bro, do you even shift? I'm not sure if he's incredibly jealous or if he's insulting me. I think we might have a stream title for, uh this portion of the stream. Okay, here's how it works. If you beat me in a race, I'll consider hanging out with you guys and driving your tired butts around town. What do you say? Or are you chicken? Let's ride. It's my understanding you've got to recruit this used car salesman to be able to recruit the pilot, which allows you to basically teleport wherever you need to go. All right, here we go. We did it. All right, here we go. We did it. Good luck. No fair. This calls for a celebration. Good luck. Oh, no. 
another victory for the VP. Oh no, that's not good. All right, here we go. Walk it off. Get up, who's gonna protect me? Yeah! You're uh. right. So close, pet. I use car. So, what can I do for you today, my man? So, you think you're some? <laughs> I'm not. Okay, here. What do you say? Let's wrap. Don't forget to protect me. We did it. Forget to protect me. Keep it up. Another victory for the VP. Don't forget to protect me. Ooh, ouch. We did it. Don't forget to protect me. Another victory for the VP. I think that does it. Guess you beat me fair and square. And a deal's a deal, so I'd be happy to tag along with you. You got a deal, pal! Imagine the headlines. I use cars. So, what can I do for you today, my man? Let's roll. Let's.
Let's roll. This was the one. Uh-uh. All right. little man what do you need swimmers keep disappearing I have a hunch there is a giant squid behind it Phew, where to start a I can't swim B aren't you supposed to handle this C that's a very specific hunch and D Be fair, I that don't want to get wet. specific hunch well I can't leave my post so that doesn't leave us many options does it will you help how dangerous do you think the squid he is a humanitarian Oh, so he likes people. That's nice. No, he's a humanitarian. That means he eats humans. But you'll be fine. Now open up. I'll blow some air into your lungs so you can breathe below. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You never said anything about mouth to mouth. Just take it like a man. You'll thank me later. Good luck, little man. First, humans should not travel underwater. It's unsafe. It's unsafe because you are making it unsafe. I am performing a public service. By dragging swimmers underwater, it sends a message to others to avoid these dangers. But you are the danger. <sighs> hey, that's just insensitive, don't you think? Oh well, let's go pound on him. All right. Here we go! Huh. <laughs> what a pushover! How do you fancy this? Yeah, how do you fancy this? You like that, huh? accomplished everyone we make a good team you guys are the brawn and I'm the brain and the looks and the fashion sense and a little bit of the brawn too
Hello there, little man. What do you need? So, what did you find out down there? Yep, squid. Big squid. Oh, I knew it! If you knew he was down there, why didn't you go take care of him a while ago? Do all you men ask so many questions? You seem slightly burlier than usual. Everything all right? Thanks to you, I lost my job. They don't need me if beaches are safe. How is that my fault? I came to this country with big dreams. Let me there. I'll give you a job. Sound good? You can be my personal bodyguard. Really? That's not a joke, is it? I am bad with political humor. No, I mean it. You can protect me from people and save me if I'm drowning. This is the happiest day of my life. I could kiss you. Stop it. We already had mouth to mouth once. That's enough for one day. Fine. Then tomorrow it is. Don't forget the body system. Let's roll. Don't forget to protect me! Well done, team! Forget to protect me. Incoming! Keep it up. Ha! Never doubted you for a second. All right, here we go. Never doubted you for a second. Do you need something? Sir, I'm swamped right now, Mr. Vice. Maybe I can sneak. Go! Cha ching! I like. 
splice that for you later. <laughs> you like that, huh? <laughs> this calls for a celebration. How can I help you? What can I do you for? Come on, fight fair! Incoming! Impressive! Yeah. We did it! Need me to exterminate some? To be honest, I'm having a hard time cleaning up Appleton here. The nest here is pretty stubborn. Maybe we could team up? What do you say? That's extermendous! Now, go stand in that field and keep the bugs away from the tree. It didn't quite go as we planned it, huh? Exter Need me to exterminate something? It didn't quite go well. The tree survives, so I guess we could try again. What do you say? That's extra. Now, go stand in that field and keep the bugs away from the tree. <laughs> It didn't quite go as we planned it, huh? Can't screw it. Go! Get him! Good luck! calls for a celebration. Hmm. I'll prune it in a jit. Go! All right, here we go. You like that, huh? I've got your back, bro. Never doubted you for a second. Don't forget to protect me. We did it. Come on, fight fair. You like that, huh? I've got your back, bro. Another victory for the <laughs> VP! Move! We have work to do! Work? You're messing up people's land. Gee, someone's moody. I thought you'd all appreciate our fun shapes. Don't humans like shapes? Yes, when they aren't cut into our food supplies. I don't understand. You got some beef with us? 
So it's not times. you, it's the shapes. So we like you, you're tasty. It's the shapes we don't like. Well, I think we need to have her a little talk and rethink our plan. Hmm? As long as their plan ends with them on a plate <laughs> with a baked potato, I'm okay with it. Uh-huh. Since when are you an expert on Grey's anatomy? How can I be of service? I can't leave my babies. It's prime pollen season after all. What a shame. Well, maybe I have an idea. What if you help me? Then I wouldn't be so... What have you got in mind? I can't go with you until they finish gathering pollen. But some of them go far from the apiary and get lost. Maybe you can keep an eye out for them. They love all sorts of flowers. If you find them, maybe you could send them back home. 